If the new Halloween film isn't enough for you, then you might be happy to know there might be a Halloween TV series in the way. Halloween producer Malachi Khad said that he's keen to get a Halloween TV show off the ground, saying it's something we're looking at very closely. But what does this mean for the franchise as a whole? Well, if the movie coming out in October is a major success, which it looks like it might be, it's hard to say for sure if another film will pop up over the next coming years. Two years ago, Fangory reported on Halloween producer Malachi Khad considering developing a Halloween TV show that would be a limited series event. More than likely being restricted to a 3-5 season commitment, such like Del Toro's TV adaptation of The Strain. So far, nothing has really been said about this up until recently. And speaking of bloody disgusting, Akkad said this, You know, it's something we've had for a long time, and I definitely want to see it done. When we started doing it, this was in development about a decade ago. And at the time, I think the thought of it was, we don't want to cannibalise the theatrical, so let's keep it as a theatrical event movie. If that starts flowing down, we would address TV. Nowadays, we all know TV is pulling out ahead of theatrical in a way that surprised everybody, especially me. Now we don't know many details about what Akkad might have in mind for the series, although he did say it would involve the character of Michael Myers in some way, and it wouldn't look like a traditional Halloween movie. He ended this off by saying, I wish I could talk about it more, but it's something we're looking at very closely. Before we start talking about anything else, it's all about the movie. With Halloween 3, the Myers mythology was abandoned and the franchise was taken down a different path. Season of the Witch, the night no one comes home. Hospital emergency room Dr. Daniel Chalice and Ellie Grimbridge, the daughter of a murder victim, uncover a terrible plot by a small town mask maker, Colonel Cochrane. A madman who's planned on a Halloween mass murder utilising the ancient Celtic ritual. The ritual involves a boulder stolen from Stonehenge, and the use of silver shamrock masks and a triggering device contained in a television commercial, all designed to kill millions of children. Now the plans were originally to turn Halloween into sort of an anthology franchise, but given the little success of the third movie, it was clear that that wasn't going to happen. In reality, as good as Halloween 1 was, by the second film, I was kind of tired of seeing Michael chase after the same girl. So having a movie that had nothing to do with Michael Myers was a relief. Now here's where I give my opinion about a Halloween TV show. It's just another way of banking from rebooting nostalgic killers. It isn't needed, like at all. Had it not been for the new movie coming out, my mind might be different, but I just think we don't need more Michael Myers. You made something good, so let it rest. For anybody saying that bringing these characters back is a good thing, is it really? Can you tell me that you truly believe this isn't another way for Hollywood to make more money? Now look at it this way, we've had 10 installments of the Halloween franchise and the 11th one is coming up in less than a month. And the new one's a direct sequel to the original. Now I'm not trying to say that this is by any means a terrible idea, but you, you gotta be honest, it's just another Hollywood cash grab. As a big Halloween fan, I'd be happy to see one more movie and then let Michael rest. In total, the Halloween franchise has made over $360 million. So look, we're all entitled to our own opinion and I won't ever try and tell you what to think. But I think it's only fair for me to tell you how I truly feel, and I don't really care for this idea all too much. Now I'm not going to go throwing any predictions around for the new Halloween film, but if it plays out how I think it might play out, then I'm happy with that. The Blumhouse team are extremely motivated to take horror and make it really good again. So if Trankus International Films do go ahead with this TV show, I wish them the best of luck. It could quite possibly be a success, but my hopes are that they do ditch Michael Myers and focus on what could truly happen on Halloween night. We all share different opinions and for making these types of videos, I have the pleasure of getting to hear your opinion on topics like this. So if you want to share your opinion about how you feel on this idea, comment it down below and we can talk about it.